destroyer escort number 13, the kind of fighting ship that helped to sink over 200 Axis subs in one year. Fast and maneuverable, hard hitting and hard to hit, with a tough sea going crew that really knows how to slug. Yet only a few months before they came aboard, four out of five were civilians. How come? Well, here's number 677. At this point, most of her future sailors are just getting their greetings from the president. While her men are in basic training, this DE is 60 days in construction, another two months in fitting out. Built in half the time of a destroyer, at half the cost, a DE can do everything a DD could do to guard a convoy. And she's really built for the job. Like the destroyers, DEs are named for naval heroes. Known as sailor ships, these fighter protectors could be called the Hellcats of the surface fleet. Then to the pier for fitting out. Guns and gear, all the things she'll need for her job. It's not quite true that a DE has guns mounted on guns and uses ash cans as armchairs. But that does give you some idea of her firepower. And here they go, sailors who've never been on a ship, on board a ship that's never been to sea. But before they do any fighting, the ship and her crew spend some time in getting acquainted, a shakedown. It doesn't take long to get the sailors' handsome luggage on board, but it does take time to stow an amazing amount of ammunition. Depth charges are still among the most effective weapons against submarines. So we take a few along. Tin fish are also likely to come in handy. 